Let's look at the way that data bits are delivered. Data bits are arranged in symbols. Each symbol includes certain number of uh, bits. Let's take an example. Assume that we have symbols in which their duration is 0.5 microsecond. It means that the symbol rate is 2 mega samples per second. Let's assume that we use for each symbol we use 6 bits. In this case, the data rate, the bit rate, will be 6, 6 bits, multiplied by the symbol rate, by 2 megabits, sorry, by 2 mega symbols per second. This will provide 12 mega bits per second. The maximum number of data bits per symbol is limited by the noise. In advanced mobile wireless protocols, when high SINR exists, a maximum of 6 bits per symbol can be used. Since the number of bits per symbol is limited by noise, one may think about increasing the bit rate by increasing the symbol rate, or in other words, by shortening the symbol time. However, there is a practical limit to the extent that symbols can be shortened. This limitation is due to the multipass that exists in the mobile wireless networks and create the phenomena called delay spread, which in its turn might cause inter-symbol interference.